Now at five, recreating the manhunt in Watertown. Three years to the day that police took Johar Sarnayev into custody. Film crews spent the day not in Watertown, but in Framingham, shooting that pivotal boat scene for the new movie Patriots Day. Christina Hager is live in Framingham tonight with the latest on this. Christina? Well, David, the neighborhood here has been crowded with people trying to get a glimpse of Hollywood's rendition of our local history. And we sat down with one man who was at the center of the real scene. Coincidental timing. It was three years ago today. Mark Wahlberg and crew reenacting what happened three years ago to this very day in Watertown. Dick Donahue, then an MBTA police officer, critically injured in a shootout between police and the Zarnayev brothers, days after they set off bombs at the Boston Marathon. At the very same time Hollywood relived it, Donahue sat down with us, awaiting word on the impending birth of his new baby boy. Any minute now, we're, we're really excited, and if I look back three years ago, it wouldn't have happened. I was just clinging to life then, and... Now it's come basically full circle. As Donahue spoke, back on the movie set, former Boston Police Commissioner Ed Davis dropped in on the crew. I've spoken with uh, uh, Peter Berg and members of the uh, movie production crew, and, and when I had that sit down, it was definitely the first thing I said was we want to be honest, we want to be accurate, we want to portray the heroism. Donahue stays in touch with the family of fallen MIT officer Sean Collier. But he chooses not to dwell on the tragedy that forever marks his calendar. April 15th, April 18th, April 19th. He called yesterday's marathon perfect. Perfect. It is. And what seemed it so is. far away on this day back then, laughter. So it, is a, it is a great day to be alive. It's, it's April 19th and it's, it's three years. So every day on this year, I'm, I'm thankful to be able to wake up and and you know, do some things I love and have a great family around me and a great community. Back live with a look at the filming in Framingham. Now, the city of Watertown turned down a request by CBS Films to create this scene in the actual neighborhood where the shootout happened. And by the way, CBS Films is a sister company of WBZ TV. I'm Christina Hager, WBZ News. David Lisa, back to you. All right, Christina, thank you.